None of these little vape things work anymore. These are mine. I was going to fix them. I wasn't going to bother doing a video, but I thought, sod it. Now they do light up, as you can see. So they are actually working, but they don't charge. So if I remember rightly, this one, I can't even get the charge port in. It's completely goose, that one. This one, it goes in. Does nothing. This one does charge sometimes. There you go. It's charging. But it, it's very particular. Well, rather typically, it's charging every time now. But trust me, it doesn't always work. Start with the black one. Let's have a look under the microscope. Holy moly. I think that one might need a new charge port. There you go, Dave. Right, let's look at the blue one. And see, that one actually looks okay. There's a little bit of a green speck on that side on the left there. Corrosion, maybe? Mm, don't know. Put that in the don't know pile. And the red one. It's a little bit dirty in there. And there's also a little bit of green. But I wouldn't have thought that would be enough for it to not work. Mind you, it is working at the minute, isn't it? That one might just need a clean. So that won't be very exciting. None of them might be exciting. But you never know, one might explode or something. And that will be fun. Well, let's start with the red one. Because that's the one that is working intermittently. I'll see if I can work out how to get into these things. Ugh. Yeah, hmm. I need to clean. Yeah. Ugh. How the... Oh, good grief. Ugh. Uh, it's quite primitive, really. There's a board, a battery, and a couple of wires. There must be a button on the other side of that. Right, let's try and figure out how to get this board out. It looks like it might be epoxied into place. I could do a disconnect of the battery, but I can't really get to the contacts because of all this epoxy's here. Uh, I was going to add some IPA, but that's probably not a good idea while it's still actual plugged in. Yeah, let's get this back under the microscope. Right, I think I've scraped enough of it away now to get to those. And the board, by the looks of it. Which I obviously didn't mean to do, but never mind. Oh, oh, oh. Right, there we go. Let's just see if some IPA will help get this black stuff up. Yes. Okay, right, well there's the charge port, isn't it? Excellent. Oh, 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 oh. Ew. <laughs> Yummy. <sighs> right. How do I get this out? I'm going to take the whole board out. I'm guessing I'm going to have to remove the gunk from this side as well. Aha. Uh -huh. Yes. Right, I can give that a good clean now, because it's gross. Right, there's the port. Go. <laughs> mm. I remember, this is the one that isn't that bad. It's pretty bad. Alright, well let's get cleaning. Voice over Steve here. Just while this live performing buffoon is cleaning this, let's give a retro shout out to the Holy Hand Grenade patrons. Tidda, Ellis Garbutt, Jamrag Berlin, Oz Newton Wine Jockey, Markovitz19, Weston himself, Adam Ardell Taylor, Jonathan Harden Daff Willie, In Flim, Jonathan Wiggs, Mick Adams, Ben Slightly Pipe, Chess Alex Weez, A1 Base Flux, Nitto Egger, Aaron Marks, Kotako Fruit Cups, N1 Tim Man, Monkey Joe Tokyo, Crinkle Lid, Fred Chauvier, Neil Reynolds, Darren Cali Medieval. Thank you. Just in case anyone's interested, this is the other side of it. So we got a little controller there, a couple of capacitors, resistors, diode, another chip. There's actually a lot more on this than I thought. More resistors, another chip, uh, some more resistors, whatever that bit is. Oh, they're the LEDs, aren't they? And that's the, the button that makes it go. And then we've got the pins here that the pod thing attaches to. Oh, God, I'm bending it. Yeah, better not do that. I'll just clean it instead. 
It's really hard to get right down inside there, and it still looks grim, even though I've just been scrubbing it. Let's try to... Ooh, yeah, that's... Yeah, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, I, I don't even want to know what that is. I suppose the problem with these things is that, obviously, you keep them in your pocket, and you get pocket lint and God knows what else. I suppose it's no different than a, than a phone. I suppose that the same thing will happen to your phone, I guess. I would normally get voiceover Steve to do something while I was dismantling these, but obviously this isn't quite as difficult as taking apart a Nintendo Switch, is it? So it doesn't take very long. I don't know what you're going to do, voiceover Steve, but you're going to have to think of something. Well, I've been told to stop singing, so I've already done it. So I was Right, see how we're looking now. Oh, Miles better. Miles better, apart from that hair. Let's get rid of that hair. Ah, there we go, look at that. Good as new. While I've got this out, I'm going to add some more solder here and here just to give it a bit more strength on the back. Might be a little bit overkill, but should give it some extra strength, I suppose. Maybe. Yeah. Let's just check these connections on this side as well while we've got it. I think they're all pretty solid, but I don't think, again, I don't think it will do any harm just to give them a gentle little reflow. I'll tidy up these battery connections as well while I'm here. Why not? Excellent. Right, let's reattach the battery. Uh, let's see if it's working. All right, let's plug the charger in. Yay! Right, so that's definitely charging. That's good news. Give it a bit of a clean in here. And definitely in here. There we go. One down, two to go. Right, so I'll look at the blue one now. I guess this is going to be as disgusting inside. Oh, it's actually not. This is the one that didn't charge at all. Right, let's get this board out and have a look under the microscope again. Right, I mean this one, it looks like it's soldered on. Yeah, and I mean it's it's dirty again. But it's nowhere near as bad as the last one. If we look inside here, there is that green stuff there. That I'm, I've tried cleaning this before and it's not worked. So I think what I'm going to do is just swap this port out. I'm going to take it off first and then I'm going to see if I've got any ports the same or similar. Leaded solder to try and lower the temperature because I'm pretty sure this will be unleaded. Want to stick there, does it? Alright, let's whack some hot air on this. See how easy it comes off. Nice. Right, I'm going to have to get some solder wick on this and 
try and clean this up. Just gonna add some more leaded to it first. Let's see if I can find a port like that. So we've got two legs on it there. Mm, let's see what I've got. Right, I think this is the closest one I've got. But it appears to have so it got a little bumpy plastic bits there. You have to cut those off because it doesn't sit flush on the board. But that should be easy enough. Yes. Shucks. Right, that's better. Go away. Right, let's try that. Yes. I think that'll do nicely. That should do it. Let's flip it over. Solid test. Solid, 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 solid. Right, let's try reconnecting the battery and see what it does. Let's see what that's doing now. Pop the charger in. Fingers crossed. Yes! Yes! It's nice and tight as well. Right, well, let's. Put that one back together. Alright, let's do the black one. And the black one is the one where the charging port was all mashed up, so this one's definitely going to need a new port. And there we go. <laughs> I don't think there's any rescue in that one, is there? Let's get it off. Well, let's attack it with high air again. Nice. I'm just going to do the same again. I'm going to use the same port. I'm going to trim those little black plastic things off. And Bob's your uncle. Nice. And time for the solid test. Solid. 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 Right, let's clean this one up and put it back together. Nice. Make sure it works. Yes, it does. Excellent. Double check these ones. This is another one that had a new port. Yep. Works like a charm. And this is the one that just needed a bloody good clean. Right, they're all working. Stupid vape things. Just a minute now. Oh, we're standing on solid rock, standing on.